the Turkish insurance agent, Junat Chaka, to model professionals wearing the captain's armbands. Gianluigi Buffon has a silver collection which includes just about everything but a Champions League winner's medal. And as Iniesta, one of four Barcelona players chasing a fourth winner's medal this evening. I think it's fair to say the Barcelona team picked itself once Iniesta declared himself fit from a car problem that he picked up in the Spanish Cup final win last weekend. He is the skipper now because Xavi is only a substitute these days. Six of that 11 started the 2011 final against Manchester United at Wembley. A seventh Pedro is on the bench tonight, but he can no longer get into the side because of the arrivals of first Neymar and then Luis Suarez will form the trident attack of 120 goals with the unique Lionel Messi. All of them will create a little bit of history this evening. More than 70,000 fans inside the Olympia Stadium. A state-of-the-art sporting venue built within the evocative design of the venue for the 1936 Olympics. Maybe a farewell to Juventus for Andrea Pirlo. Lionel Messi has scored in each of his two Champions League finals. Nobody has scored in three finals in the modern era. The Spanish Cup winners and champions meet the Italian Cup winners and champions for the ultimate treble for the title of Europe's best football team. It's a game of thrones. Night gathers in Berlin. Two teams at the peak of their powers, Andy. They knocked out the last two European champions in the semi-finals. Worthy finalists both. How progressive they're going to be. They're just going to sit there and stay quite narrow to the two centre-halves and let the rest of this... Messi. He's aware of Jordi Alba making inroads. Neymar's first touch, just a little heavy. Nothing wrong with that, though. Iniesta and a chance early on, and Rakitic has put Barcelona in front inside four minutes. A goal that had Barcelona written all over it. Sharp passing, good movement. And Rakitic had the easy bit, just steering it into the net. Fantastic start for Barcelona. It's a brilliant, brilliant goal. Juve are obviously a bit narrow because they play the diamond, so that switch gives Jordi Alba a lot of room, good composure from Neymar. What about that for a ball? You know, Vido doesn't go with a run, he just allows Iniesta to go in there, and then, of course, you know that he's going to drop that on a plate, on a sixpence for Rakitic. He just, just finishes it off beautifully. That's a stunning goal, and what a start to this game. A year ago, Ivan Rakitic was... Man of the match in the Europa League final, the skipper of Sevilla, his farewell to them before moving on and up to Barcelona, where he has effectively taken the place of Xavi in the team and has beaten Gianluigi Buffon in just over three and a half minutes. Imagine what they're thinking, imagine all the hours they've spent talking about how are we going to deny them, how are we going to stop them, how are we going to contain that front three. In just a few minutes, they're already trailing. So now they did they score when they had to in Madrid in the did. semi-final. And Barcelona do tend to leak a goal or two away. trying to wriggle into some space, halted by Pogba, but this far since 2011, overdue by their modern standards. It's a ball, that Immediately down to work. You're right, Clive Vidal, you'd expect a little bit more composure. Wonderful composure. Bonucci penalised, Messi back on the ball, stepping away from Vidal. Dani Alves. Messi, Neymar, 
He's found some space. Oh. And they can now play the match at their tempo and their style. The Juventus have somehow got Messi. There's a foul by Ebra. Third time he's faced Lionel Messi in a Champions League final, though Messi played infield in both 2009 and 2011. Messi switched it towards Neymar! Just couldn't quite catch up with it. Instead of being on the end of things at the moment, Messi's the architect of it all. He's drifting in off that right side. He's hitting 30, 40 yard diagonals. That one's a really clever pass for Neymar. Almost oh. has got to get closer to him. Here they come again. Lionel Messi. Luis Suarez has cut it back. Danny Alves, fabulous save by Buffon. Hit it out of harm's way by Licksteiner. That was a tremendous stop by the Juventus skipper. Danny Alves it was who crept in unnoticed. Great football again. Perfect pick out, wasn't it, from Suarez. And, you know, Buffon is unsighted there. He's got bodies in the way. He doesn't really know. He's almost gambled going to his right. He's had to throw a big hand out to the left to get something on that that's a game-saving moment that really is that's as good as a goal that Messi clipped into the path of Neymar swinging open again everything's a little bit too easy at the moment for Barca to get in behind Juve and to Messi Busquets. Time for PK. No time for Messi. Rakitic to Messi. We just need to stay in it and grow into this game, Juventus. Don't need to rush anything. Pogba and Marquez, the other two wide midfield players, because they play that diamond, they want to stay nice and compact and not allow Barca away through the middle. But every time Suarez back to Alves, here's Messi. Could just handle the ball, I think. The two liberties at the back, pinching possession high up the field. Danny Alves tried the back heel. Threat out of it if they feel as if their opponents are starting to gain a foothold in the match. Messi, then they change gear. Neymar slip, but still managed to head it into the path of Suarez. This place pass from Messi. Worked short between Messi and Neymar. Seem to be on the Messi. One or two moments already when they've tried to play their way out, they caused their problems but didn't panic. Same belief is there. Just play their way out and they've got the ball back. It came off Messi and Tevez couldn't resist making a challenge for the ball. Brought down his opposite number. Juventus will hope that from one of their set. Alves to Messi. Pilo's beat himself. Good recovery by Bazzali. Mascherano. Run here is by Suarez. Bazzali's header comes for Leno Messi. He's been penalised. Juventus free kick. Instant control from Messi. Suarez headed away by Bazzali. 
Pogba trying to make something of it, just easing Messi off the ball. Dispossessed though by Dani Alves. Messi. Oh, and Pogba leapt in on Lionel Messi from behind there. Uncontrolled challenge by the youngest player on the field. Cards out for Paul Pogba. Again, lunging in. Didn't have to. So Patrice Evra was about to slow Lionel Messi up. Maybe just tripped himself a wee yeah, bit there, I think, he? trying to adjust his feet and clattered into him. Messi, three swarming around him, just sucks them in and lays the ball off. Tempting Vidal this time. Shows it to him once more, almost like a battador. Toying with him a little bit here, Lionel Messi. He wants him, he's inviting the challenges, particularly from those two. Vidal and Pogba. Good recovery by Pirlo. were threatening to overrun them in those opening exchanges. Void by that early goal from Ivan Rakitic. Messi, held up only by Pogba. Messi goes on, he's beaten two of them, he's going past the third, it's Lionel Messi. I don't know if you've seen the goal that he scored in the Spanish Cup final last weekend when he beat four and the goalkeeper on his near post. Once he gets in the box, no, no, nobody dare touch him. I mean, actually, in the end... Oh, look, they're back on the, uh, back on the escalator, and why not? Um, the team talk's fairly straightforward, I'd imagine, from Barca. Same again, just carry on playing the same way. Yeah, I think they will not change the way how they're playing. Like... Tich had made a run into the box, dealt with by Bonucci. This is Messi. Dani Alves. Messi away from Fidel. Well, it's just Messi, Neymar, Messi, Suarez, Lionel Messi. Oh. Sumptuous build-up. Didn't get what it deserved in the end from Lionel Messi. Only surprise there was that Messi blazes it over the bar, but a lovely little interplay there. And then all of a sudden Suarez gets involved, and he just wondered if he was going to go back across the goal there to. Be... Iniesta fed forward towards Messi. Well seen by Bonucci. Quick as Bonucci. Messi's got it back. Good finish. Messi. Jordi Alba steaming for Bonucci. Evra. Lost it to Messi, almost got it back from him. And here they come with PK leading a breakout, and Messi on the ball. Three forward for Barcelona. Messi has found Neymar. Messi. PK still in there. Oh, well. Iniesta fed in towards Lionel Messi. And even the Barcelona counter up. Can't bring that one under his spell. Never a caught in possession. Fabulous. Right, but always at the goalkeeper. This league final. Yeah. Messi coming looking for the ball. Yeah. That will roll out same before a goal kick. More live football on this channel tomorrow lunchtime. We are in Dublin for. to Messi, Barcelona on the counter-attack, 
Lionel Messi on the charge. Messi! Saved by Buffon. It's in. It's Luis Suarez. It's Barcelona back in front. What a response. It's a fantastic final. Fantastic celebrations down in front of the Barcelona supporters. Luis Suarez's first goal for five weeks is the most critical of his first season at Barcelona. Stunning, and they've done that so often this season. Once Messi gets here, in behind the midfield, running at the defence, with those options of Suarez and Neymar either side, you know you're in trouble. It's a decent stop in many respects from Buffon, but Suarez was just alive, just a bit sharper, just a bit more aware of where that ball might drop. Not be any part of the deliberation, it's simply whether it's deliberate. Meanwhile, Lionel Messi. Here's me again, well seen by Mascherano. Lionel Messi quickening to get right. to the ball. Tremendous challenge by Everett. Maybe. Neymar volunteering, but I think he's in. His uh, suggestion will be politely declined. Compelling final. It's Lionel Messi. He got it up, but not down. The tame effort in the true stars. was, in the end, yeah. Well, they've had three or four situations, second half, where they've had men over, they've had... Messi. Early four towards Neymar. No flag here. Neymar's cut it back to Lionel Messi. Oh, just lost his footing at the did. critical moment. Absolutely did. Tripped over himself. Midway through this second half when Alvaro Morata put them on terms, but Luis Suarez's goal has changed the tide again in the match. Barca are ten minutes away. And have another free kick. Joint leading goal scorer in this season's Champions League at the moment. Lionel Messi with Cristiano Ronaldo. Here's Dani Alves. Messi now Busquets. Messi, Dani Alves, cut back towards Luis Suarez. Oh, Xavi almost got in there. And here's Llorente. Oh, what a challenge by Mascherano. Messi restoring some order. Tremendous control under pressure, helped on by Suarez, and here goes Lionel Messi, good recovery by Benucci. Very good challenge. And free kick has gone Juventus this way. And got it back, but it's Suarez, and now Messi with Neymar up with him. It's gone away from Coma. Messi to Neymar. Couldn't quite squeeze it back into Messi for the Spanish Cup together last weekend. Messi, head to the ball, forced away, Messi can counter, Neymar just onside, now can they finish it off with a goal, Pedro, it's Neymar, it's game, set and match, Barcelona! The perfect finale, delivered by Neymar. Classic counter attack again. It's just whether or not Neymar was he just offside or was he just made that run from his own half. It doesn't matter. It's all irrelevant. He holds his run importantly there on the edge of the box, and it's an emphatic finish. Boss, not quite the Guardiola full house of six years ago, but Luis Enrique has won the three. And they've been successful in the Champions League era, and in that respect, they draw level with Real Madrid. Modern masters of Europe. And it's the Marcel style of their football that has set them apart from other champions. A style that's been refined by football when 
But when Barcelona pass well, nobody does it better. Luis Enrique has carried that on. More than a club is the motto of the club, and that's certainly true of the manner in which they represent their region, Catalonia, associated with the club since he was 11. They haven't grown much. Xavi has never formally received the trophy, although he's running forward to his club career. A record 151 in this competition. What a way to go. Field player to another. Thoroughbred champions, pure and simple. Barcelona, European champions once more, four times inside a decade. They've done the treble again, and they've done it their way. The Barca anthem rings out around the stadium. Only Real Madrid and AC Milan won this great prize more times than Barcelona now. Their fifth triumph equals the mark of both Bayern Munich and Liverpool. Two of those five won at Wembley in 92 and 2011, Paris in 2006, Rome in 2009, and now another capital city, Berlin, to add to the favourite spots in Europe of every Barcelona fan. The landmarks on a journey that has been a, a joy to behold. One thing's for sure, Barcelona are always worth watching.